Grabbed off his stick by Spencer Stastny. And it's Stastny heading up ice for Notre Dame. One on three. Stastny to the backhand. Scores! What a goal! Spencer Stastny! Well, this entire play starts with a turnover created on the blue line. So important to hold that line. That's exactly what the Fighting Irish are able to do. Then they transition this puck up. And how about this little backhand play? One on three. That's a dump and change right there. One nothing Notre Dame. And what did Bobby Nardella tell us this morning? Easily the best skater on the team, Spencer Stasty. His confidence has just grown in leaps and bounds, and we saw why just there. Bell pushing it down for Pavlichev. In front there, ricochets around. Morris keeps it out, but on the rebound, Sam Sternschein has tied it. Well, you wondered, with all this zone time, would the Nittany Lions be rewarded? And they were not deflated by Smirnoff missing the breakaway chance. They just kept pressuring, and Sternschein ties it up. Well, it might be the fourth line, but they have scored a ton of significant goals. And even when you look at this team, Nikita Pavlichev has five power play goals. Sternschein has three. They might be fourth on the depth chart, but they still have quite a bit of offensive prowess and really playing down around Kale Morris, trying to make the netminder make that proverbial second save. Jones, the save, the rebound lingers. There's Burke! One of the things Jeff Jackson wants in one of his game objectives is winning net front battles, getting scoring opportunities, and Cal Burke wins a battle here and makes some pay. That all of a sudden is going to make this intermission break feel quite a bit different. Well, Cal Burke moved to center from wing after he came back from Christmas and he had to endure an appendectomy and missed some time. Right off the faceoff, tearing forward. Byro checking his options. That changed directions. Nittany Lions say they scored. As Penn State, it appears, has tied it. Marsh corralling the puck. And as he shoots, watch number six, Tori Dello, or it's Byro. I know it was Marsh right out in front. Yeah, Marsh is going to get a stick on this, but watch Tori Dello give the business right there after the fact. It's him low. And with Berger crashing the net, you know they're going to take a very close look at this, but clearly the puck is in. This is, didn't see him coming. Morrison scores! It's deja vu all over again for Cam Morrison, the Colorado Avalanche second round pick. 9.23 of overtime last March 17th in the Big Ten Championship game. Almost from that exact same spot, wasn't it, Ben? Well, it's all about zone entry here, and that provides a gap because the forward who gets this puck over the line and drives the defense back, that allows not only an opportunity for Morrison to shoot, but some net front presence in front of the netminder Peyton Jones who made him fight a little bit harder to try to see that shot. That's angled wide. 12 seconds to go. Spencer Stastny steals, clears. They wave off an icy. Notre Dame back-to-back Big Ten Tournament Champions.
Win number 500 for the living legend, Jeff Jackson. Just the 13th man to do so in college hockey. Penn State's Guy Godelski on the right congratulating the winning head coach Jeff Jackson.